this tutorial covers how to secure a site by staying informed about the latest security updates. By the end of this tutorial, you'll know how to keep up with the latest security updates in order to ensure that your site is as safe and up-to-date as possible. While not strictly speaking required, before you start with this tutorial, it's a good idea to familiarize yourself with what security updates are, why they're important, and how they're created. See the written version of this tutorial for links to each of these prerequisites. There are a few different ways to receive notifications of security releases, and we'll walk through each of them briefly. First up, you can configure your site to notify you of updates. This method is especially useful because it only notifies you about things that are relevant to your site. In the Manage Administration menu, navigate to Reports, Available Updates, and then Settings. On this page, you can enter the email address or addresses to be notified when updates are available. You can also specify whether you want daily or weekly updates. Once you're done, click Save Configuration. Assuming you have cron configured appropriately for your site, Drupal will now automatically check for available updates for all of the modules or themes that your site is making use of and send a regular email to the email addresses provided. Another option is to subscribe to the security announcements email list. Here, you'll get an email, usually once a week, with all security announcements for that week, including core and all monitored contrib modules. To subscribe, log in to drupal.org go to your user profile page and subscribe to the security newsletter by clicking on edit and then my newsletters and checking the box for security announcements and clicking save. Also on drupal.org, you can navigate to drupal.org security, which lists all available security announcements in reverse order, as well as provides a link to the Drupal security Twitter account, which you could follow to get updates. And finally, if you prefer, you can subscribe to one or more of the RSS feeds for core security updates, contributed project updates, and public service announcements, all available at drupal.org. In this tutorial, we looked at various ways you can subscribe to get notified about security updates for core and contributed modules, including via your site itself, via the security mailing list on drupal.org, by Twitter, or by subscribing to one of the drupal.org security RSS feeds.